Hydrogen is the most dominant atomic form in the universe left over from the Big Bang and a lot of planets are formed predominantly from hydrogen. If we want to understand the, how hydrogen behaves deep inside these planets, then we have to study it at very high pressures. What we use is something called a diamond anvil cell, which is this thing here. So this has two halves, there's a diamond in each half, and it's between these diamonds that we compress the sample. As we increase the pressure, the hydrogen first goes to a liquid. We keep squeezing it up in pressure, the hydrogen turns into a solid. Theory predicts that maybe somewhere near 5 million times atmospheric pressure, these crystals of hydrogen will become metallic. It will look like any other shiny metal. Hydrogen, before it gets to the metallic phase, may have some very other exotic properties. Again, all predicted by theory at the moment. It may become a superfluid, that is a fluid with absolutely no viscosity whatsoever. And metallic hydrogen itself might be, might be, a room temperature superconductor. Again, something which hasn't been seen by in any other material yet. If we want to squeeze large volumes of materials such as hydrogen up to very high pressures and simultaneously heat them up to the temperatures you find deep within planets, then we're going to need diamonds that big. We don't have the money or the machinery to do it yet, but it's certainly a 10-year goal to grow such diamonds.